Hi, this is Paul Turley, and I'm going to show you the SolidQ DataRace solution for the Power BI Showcase. DataRace is a service and a website developed and maintained by SolidQ in Italy with data from Timing Data Service. Uh, it contains about five years worth of athletic events, mainly in Southern Europe. Uh, there are about 4,000 events on record so far with about 1.8 million participants. Uh, running in those events. And uh, you can see here that people come from about 109 different countries. Here you can see the location of the different events. If we were just to slice this down to 2016, you can see that we're now down to nine events. You can see the distribution of racers across gender, then by discipline and by event classes. Then you can see the location of each, uh, each of those events. If I were to click on Rome, you would see that there were 2,200 participants in this event. And clicking on that bubble lets me uh, slice or pare down the data. I can see that most of those 2,200 people are coming from Italy, but uh, a number of people coming from all over the world. The point of data race is really for an athlete to compare their performance against their competitors at these events. So since we have so many people, uh, we filter first by the first letter of the first name and surname, and then I can select a person's. In this scenario, we're going to say that my name is Abel Andrew, and uh, I going to choose my name, and you'll see that I have run in four events so far. And I'm going to go ahead and choose this marathon event. And for that event, uh, I ran alongside 1,360 people. And my results were, I came in 387th place out of 1,361. That puts me approximately in the top third of all of those racers. You can see that my result time was 97 minutes compared to an average result time of 106 for my competitors. And my pace time was 4.59 minutes to run one kilometer, a little bit better than the average. Here are all of my competitors in this event. Let's go ahead and sort that by the result time. And you can see that Nicholas was actually the winner of that erase, followed by Henry. So this is a great tool to help athletes compare their performance against their competitors.